If your iPhone or iPad storage is pushing its limit and you want to clean up your device, it's easy to delete screenshots to free up some space. Here's how. Welcome to Ellen's Tips for iOS. If you're finding these videos useful, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. I don't want you to miss a thing. Let's get started. Locate the Photos app on your device. As you can see, mine is located on the home screen, but if you don't see yours, pull down on the home screen to expose Apple Spotlight search, and then begin typing in photos. And when you do, you'll see the Photos app appear. Tap on Photos to open. Once the Photos app is open, you'll want to come down to the bottom of the screen and tap on Albums. Now that we're into the album section, scroll down to Media Types and select Screenshots. On the iPad, if you're in portrait mode, open the sidebar by tapping up in the left-hand corner on Photos. Scroll down until you see Media Types and then select Screenshots. Now you can see all of your screenshots stored on your device. You can delete one screenshot by tapping on any thumbnail and then on the iPhone, tapping on the trash can in the lower right hand corner. On the iPad, the trash can will be in the upper right hand corner. Once you tap on the trash can, you'll need to confirm by tapping on Delete Photo. If you want to delete multiple photos at one time, you can do so by tapping on the Select icon in the upper right-hand corner. And now you have an option where you could select all and delete all of those photos. So if I tap on it, you'll see that a check mark appears in the lower right hand corner of each photo. And so all photos are selected. I can then tap on the trash can. And when I do, then I would have to confirm that I want to delete all of those photos. But maybe we just want to delete a few of those photos. Again, tap on select and then select the photos that you want to delete and tap on the trash can and then confirm by tapping on delete three photos. You can also, you can also uh, choose a group of photos by tapping on select and maybe we just want to uh, delete 10 photos that are in a grouping together. And so if I select one and then drag my finger across to the other photos that I want to delete. Now I've selected what looks to be about 12 photos. I can tap on the trash icon, tap on delete 12 photos, and those 12 photos will be deleted. That's pretty much it. Apple will store these deleted photos in the recently deleted album for 30 days. If you want to remove them sooner or you want to take a look to see what you've recently deleted, all you need to do is tap on Albums in the upper left-hand corner and scroll to Utilities until you see Recently Deleted. Each photo will tell you the days remaining until it will be deleted. Choose Select again and you can delete these photos sooner if you choose to, but once you do, they will be permanently deleted. Once you've deleted them, there's no going back. They will be permanently lost. Now you need to take some more screenshots and follow along again. This method also works for any photos that you've stored in, in your photos library. It's a great way for freeing up storage. Check out your other albums and see what photos you can get rid of. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time.